So what are you doing, Damash? I'm digging a hole to check to see if I've got mud that the mason bees will use in their nest. Well, that looks like mud. What are you looking for in that mud? I'm checking to see if it has the texture that a bee is looking for to, to be able to use it in her nest. And um, what is that texture? It should be like clay or, or dough. And when it's wet, is, that's when you really want to test it. So we're going to pour some water into the hole. Okay. So that we can know. Okay. We're going to see if it sticks together when it's wet. What do you think about that mud? Uh, it feels a little grainy. It's not, I can't really mold it into a ball. Well, it's pretty good, but we want to make sure that our mason bees have the right kind of clay. I think this might be a little gritty. So I'm going to make the hole a little bigger so that I can add mud, mud mix. Mud is really important. The mason bees won't nest in, in your yard if they can't find the right kind of clay mud. What do they use the mud for anyway? Why, why do bees need mud? That sounds silly. The mason bees are going to pick up this mud and make a wall between each nesting chamber to protect each egg that they're laying. So and then at the very end they're going to build uh, an extra thick layer of mud to protect the last egg laid. Okay, so what we've got is our mason bee mud mix. And it comes in a bag and it's dry. You can see it's a powder. We're gonna add water to the bag. So we're gonna try not to make a mess, so we're gonna just add water to the bag. You don't have to use a bowl just slowly add some water and knead it inside the bag. It's okay if you add too much water because it's going to dry out and some of the water is going to go go into the soil. This can be a little messy but this is a clay mix and it's just the right texture that bees like. And this is plenty of mud for your, your, your season of mason bees. Okay, so now we're going to just pour this into the hole. And a vertical hole, <laughs> it's a little watery. <laughs> so a vertical hole is, um, is actually better for bees because they can find the right spot in the water, the, the water level. Throughout the day as it dries out, they'll go down a little farther. They can get it from the side. So. That's, that's a source of mud. Cool. 